What is up, everybody? YouTube, this is your boy Derek Vincent back with another video, and this is I'm Rosa, I'm his girlfriend. Yes, yes, yes. So, today we are doing a video. It is April 8th, uh, yeah, it's April 8th, Friday, four o'clock, and we're doing a video on the jackets we wore during the fall and the winter time, um, particularly like puffer coats and everything like that. So, I wanted to make this video during the season, but you know, stuff that happens. Uh, with schedules and everything so we're doing this video now to show you the coats that we we uh, wore so to start off puffer coat, collection. puffer coat collection we have a a lot of coats in this video so um bear with us but we have some pictures to go with it too to show you guys how it looked and how we wore them and everything like that and where we got it from how much it was etc etc um so We'll uh, start off. So first off, the first coat I want to show you guys is my tan puffer coat that I picked up from Zara. This coat got was like thirty dollars. It was a crazy steal. Um, actually, it was twenty five. And here in Rhode Island, there's no sales tax on like clothes or anything, so it was exactly twenty five dollars. Super clean coat. Um, this is the pick I have right here. I'm a big fan of like earth tone colors and this this jacket was just a still originally the, the the tag said 55 actually the tag said 90 and i was like Ugh, i guess i'll just buy it like it's, it's it was like the end of february or early february and i was like you know i can still wear it for like two and a half months so and then come to find out i had the wrong tag on it it was on sale and everything so crazy still picked that up from zara and that's the first coat. And now she's gonna talk about one of her coats. So the main coat that I wore when it was really cold, it's also tan, it's like a beige tan color. Mm -hmm. It's from Garage. Got it for like 85, 90-ish dollars mm -hmm. about. Um, it, back in like November, it was like a really, it was some, it was a necessity, so. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we'll show a picture. The garage is a is a, is a is a solid store. Not gonna lie, we we went to a garage in Providence and in Boston, mm -hmm. um, and very solid store mm -hmm. um, for you for you girls out there. So definitely a solid store. Next yes. coat, um, <clears throat> we're gonna be talking about vests. So before we like, cause we have only two vests I want to talk about. So I have this white and black Nike vest which I picked up in the summertime mid, like literally I picked it up for like, wait, it was like what, July? No, I think it was May. It was May? Around my birthday. So yeah, like yeah, yeah. So it was like mid-May and I picked up this in a uh, thrift store in Vermont, Burlington, Vermont. And, I, and it was it was solid. Like this is how it looks right here. Like, you know, it's kind of tight. It was, a, it was a large. I could have used the XL, but it's not a big deal. But I got that for like, I think I got that one again for like $25. I wasn't expecting to buy anything that day either. And at that time I was broke too. So I was like, like I needed, like I need, I didn't need it, but I'm glad I got it. This is a pick with me in it as well. How I wore it, how I, how I like fashioned it up and everything. Just with some jeans and the Air Forces right there, classic solid fit. So yeah, guys, that was a, that was a, a good little purchase I got from Vermont. So now on um, her turn so this next vest um i was at the mall one time without him and i sent him a picture on snapchat i was like this vest is actually so cute and it was like 50 ish right i don't remember i, yeah. I used a credit card i think it was like 50 dollars, and i was like i really don't need it so i just sent him a picture and then what about my day the day before Valentine's comes, he's like, I have to go up to Providence. I my sister needs me for something. So I was like, okay, like, yeah, of course, go help your sister. But then Valentine's comes along and he tells me to close my eyes and hold out my hands. And so I did. And what I felt was like a like a puffy, like soft material. So I opened my eyes, it was the best. And I was like That was that was a good you're, little Yeah, you're that, that was clever. You know the vibe. Clever. Come on now. Come on now. I got Valentine's Day. I, we should do a little like Valentine's Day haul, but I hooked her up with some like a workout fit, like a top and bottom mm -hmm. workout fit, um, matching uh gym fit. Got her a jacket, got her some shoes. I was really, I hooked her up. Zara is really my favorite, one of my favorite stores. Probably is my favorite store for clothes. So yeah, this is, again, this is how it looks. This is how um, it looks on like the body and everything. And then again, this is this is a fit that she wore in Boston. And this is how it looked on her mm -hmm. fit. And um, perfect, perfect, 
perfect jacket. I love the green. The green is just like a really bold color, a neon. It was green. coincidental because it's green, and I wore it on St. Patrick's Day. I had no idea it was even St. Patrick's yeah, Day. Yeah, St. Pat. Like, like I didn't know. I didn't know it was St. Patrick's <laughs> Day at all. Like I was very out the loop this year with that. But I don't celebrate it anyway. So, um, so yeah. The next cool I want to talk about is again. I have. So I got a gift over the winter break. Um, I don't have any brothers, you know. I, I'm the only boy of five. So one of my one of my guys I look up to, who's like 28, 27. Um, he was. It was. It had snowed a snowstorm, and it was just a really cold morning. I had to go to work, and he had to pick us all up to go to work. And he was wearing this black puffer coat with the Nike Bala Kava. Um, like face mask thing that's used for soccer and football and i was like yo like that fit the fit was fire like it really was and i was just i asked him that same day i was like where'd you get this jacket from like i'm going i'm li literally about to buy it right now and he was like you want it and i was like like of course so he literally like the next day gave me the jacket and this is the jacket right here it's a marmot jacket hand me down um, you cannot go wrong, bro. Like this is just a fire coat and it's a coat that's straight from one of my guys I look up to and um, ask for advice. So this is how it looks on me. This is how I wore it in a picture. I, I literally copy pasted his whole fit. Like I bought the balacava vest, um, face mask and I had got the jacket, had the black jeans, had the bread of lemons on, clean, clean fit. Um, and then this is actually the fit that we took together to me and her when we were in Boston. So we both had like our puffer coats on for this night in Boston. So that was one of my favorite. Um, that's one of my favorite jackets, honestly. So um, yeah, what's what's your coat next? What's your next coat? Um, I also have a black puffer coat. Mm -hmm. um, I got it Zara for like forty dollars, mm -hmm. and you know it's not as heavy as my like tannish one, but it's like it's great for like you know 40 degree 50 degree weather like right. it's super light but like it gets the it, job done exactly it's universal exactly and black goes with everything of course like right. can't go wrong with black so and it's cropped too so right love that and this is how it looks on on her i don't know if she has any pics with it uh, I don't even know. Well, I think you do when we're in the, the garage, the shop, the garage in the mall, and you had like the Nike the Yankee hat on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's this is how it looks on her feed, Instagram feed follower. This is how it looks on her. This is how it looks if you guys were to buy it again, forty dollars. Um. So yeah, the next coat is again another black coat that um I got from Boston called Buffalo Exchange, which is a thrift store out there. And if you watched the last vlog, I put up the Boston vlog. Um, you guys would see. So yeah, I got this coat for $25 and I wasn't even trying to buy anything, but the coat was just, it was too, like, too, I could not have gotten it. Like $25, a super light coat. And the reason why I got it was, it was a soup, the marmot coat is just heavy. And the zipper, like, since it was a hand-me-down, the zipper didn't work and it was a big patch on the, on the left side of the coat. So I wanted like a, you know, just a solid black coat that I can just wear anywhere, a light coat you know etc so i picked that up from for 25 dollars. this is how it looks um i do have one pick that i took today i probably won't post it but this is how i wore it today and we just came back um had a look just doing errands and stuff so so yeah that was um a black coat i have and then the last thing she's going to talk about is a nice little accessory that is puffer like so we'll talk about that yes yeah, so it's a bag and it has like the puffer material. I actually don't know if I have any pictures with it. Do I? Do I don't know. But I like we do. we can just show you how it looks. Right now. Oh well, yeah, but yeah. like even in the So this is it. Um the brand is my mom made it and she was a little pricey and not even gonna lie, she was a hundred dollars. But I didn't know it was a hundred dollars. Yes. I saw I saw I think it was I was on Instagram and I saw like just like, you know, a sponsored like picture for it. And I was like, that's so cute. So I I had to get it. Like, yeah, yeah it was a little expensive, but it's, it's so cute. And it's like spacious too. I'm gonna say it's like, a, it's a solid bag. She's gonna we're showing it like here too, but we're gonna show like a little extra clip yeah. of how it looks and how it just how it's like you yeah. know what it is but it's it's a good brand it's it's durable it's you know it came with multiple colors it came with brown a light pink and i think a light yellow right or like a green 
it was like an off white type of color. Oh, off white. Yeah. yeah, that's what it was. But so yeah, that was a uh, that was a nice little purchase. I I love brown, so I was I was a big fan for the brown. Um, and then last two, these are the two jackets I had uh, from high school into going into college. And these are just two North Face light coats, similar to the black one, which was a Tommy Hilfiger coat. Um, these are just two North Face puffer coats, not the the 1998 Nupset version that everybody has. I do want that, but that's such a big coat, and it just takes up so much space in the, in the dorm room and in my closet. So next year, I probably will buy one. Um, and not I probably will buy like a, a color coat that I don't have either. But speaking on these, I do have a navy blue coat and a, and a red one. And um, these are how it looks on me. I don't think I ever actually took a pick with the red one, but I do have a pick with the blue one here. And yeah, it's a, it's a nice solid coat. Again, not too heavy, not too light. Gets the job done. And um, so yeah, these are the coats that got us through, you know, late September all the way to literally like two weeks ago. Like even last week it was freezing out and then now today is like almost 70 degrees. It's, you know, New England when it comes, when it's transitioning from winter to spring is a weird time. So, but like I said, today is like 70 degrees. Everybody's wearing shorts and tanning outside and going to the beach and stuff today. So it's a little cold for that, but it's, yeah. it's a little cold for that. But people are doing it though. Like we, like we literally were have it going all over the place today, and uh, and uh, yeah. So other than that though, guys, like I said, we're having some some footage of how we wore the coats and how like Instagram pictures that we posted them in them and everything like that. Um, some honorable mentions. I do have a. Uh, you know, a bomber jacket that I, I wore, that I got from, um, not even a bomber, it was a varsity jacket that I had from high school. Um, and, I, and that's another warm coat that I had throughout the, the winter. And I posted a pic in it right here. Um, so yeah, follow us on Instagram, um, social media at SincerelyDVP and Rosa dot M O H R M A N N. I was say, I thought she was about to say she forgot her Instagram. Because so. my email is located the same well Just, we're talking about social media yeah. not emails oh i know but, but yo leave me alone. but okay guys quick little video i hope you guys enjoy more more videos on the way again um i'm graduating next month so i'm, I'm i have more time on my hand i'm trying to do a video I, I know i always say that in these videos but my birthday is next month i'm yes it is her birthday but yeah i'm graduating next month hopefully i can do like a graduation vlog or something like that but yeah, guys, more videos on the way. Have a lot of ideas and um, have a good one. Peace.